Hello, everyone, and welcome back to MSN Construction YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be diving into the fascinating world of concrete column design. Specifically, we'll be exploring the British Standard 8110, BS 8110, and its significance in the construction industry. So, whether you're a civil engineer, a construction enthusiast, or simply curious about concrete column design, you're in the right place. Let's get started. Section 1. Understanding BS 8110. Before we delve into the specifics of concrete column design, let's take a moment to understand what BS 8110 is. BS 8110 is a British standard that provides guidance on the design and construction of reinforced and pre-stressed concrete structures. It covers various aspects of concrete design, including columns, beams, slabs, and more. In today's video, we'll focus on its application to concrete column design. Section 2. Key Design Parameters Designing a concrete column involves considering several important parameters to ensure the safety and stability of the structure. Here are some key design parameters covered in BS 8110. Load Calculation Before designing a column, we need to determine the loads it will be subjected to such as dead loads, live loads, and environmental loads. Material Properties Understanding the properties of concrete and reinforcing steel is crucial for column design. Axial Load and Moment Columns are designed to resist axial loads, compression or tension, and bending moments that may be present in the structure. Slenderness Ratio The slenderness ratio plays a role in determining the column's capacity to resist buckling. Section 3. Design Steps Now, let's walk through the steps involved in designing a concrete column with BS 8110. Load Combinations We consider various combinations of loads that the column may experience during its lifetime. Analysis and Design Using the load combinations, we analyze the column's behavior and design it to meet the necessary strength and stability requirements. Reinforcement Calculation Based on the column's dimensions and the design loads, we calculate the required amount of reinforcing steel. Check for serviceability. Apart from strength, we also ensure that the column meets serviceability criteria, such as deflection limits. Section 4. Conclusion. That brings us to the end of this video on Concrete Column Design with BS 8110. We've explored the significance of the British Standard 8110, discussed key design parameters, walked through the design steps and you guys better if go through an example remember, proper column design is crucial for the overall stability and safety of a structure. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel for more construction related content, and hit the notification bell to stay updated. If you have any questions or topics, you'd like us to cover in future videos, please let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Stay safe and keep building amazing structures. Goodbye.